Look at that. We picked up a Bronto. The way an RG used to look before, before the old TLC. Oh, I miss this. What's up, guys? It's King Daddy D Mac, and welcome! Welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved! That's right, we're playing here with Ark Eternal! Having so much fun doing flips! My goodness, how's everybody doing today? I hope you're doing well, because me. I'm doing pretty amazing. That's right, because today is finally the day we are going to, one, tame one of my most favorite creatures in this mod and finally do all those vanilla boss fights. I know it's not that important to do the vanilla fights, but I would like to. Let me see. Where, where can I bring it up in Ingrams? Ingrams. There are a few random tech Ingrams that I've not yet unlocked that I'd like to. I don't remember who unlocks it, but I'm pretty positive if I do uh, at least the four basic hard mode bosses, one of them should. So, uh, yeah, we've been working the last few days trying to get all the resources uh, automated to be able to do as much of this as we want. So hopefully we can now do that. Get out of here, guys. I said... Go! This thing is so nuts. Let's go ahead, grab all the goodies. Oh, does it harvest the bodies from it too? I don't get the polymer or anything. All right, all right. Come on, get out. Ooh, did you summon in? Were you a summon in? All right, go, go, get. All right, anyway. Oh my goodness, we got another guy. A space panda. I can't remember if we have to tame him to unlock his saddle or just to feed him. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hold out for a better one. That was only a 520. But yeah, pretty cool. It's a pretty good creature too. All right. Anyway, let's get this show on the road. Let's start getting all the vanilla bosses summoned in. Yeah, look at it. We got it saddled. Sweet. So for next time, we'll actually be able to use it. I don't know. Anyway, um, where were we? Let's grab the summoner. Beautiful. And I should hopefully have every and all the resources needed, all the artifacts, and all the other shenanigans. So let's go ahead, summons, right? Or is it under Matrix? Matrix, Vanilla Boss, and let's start off with the Broodmother and Hard Mode. Awesome. But uh, yes, while we're waiting for it to be summoned in, guys, just want to remind you, if you're enjoying the series, to show that amazing support by slamming that thumbs up button. And if you're new to the channel or you haven't yet, seriously, what are you waiting for? It is the perfect time to subscribe. That's right. Also, be sure to come check out the Discord. Link is in the description below. All are welcome. Come be part of the Mac Pack. And remember, we do have a member server for both right now. We have up Eternal, we have up Omega, and we have up, what's the other one? Arc Supreme. Yeah, so if you're a YouTube member or Twitch subscriber, you are welcome to join and have those three servers to choose to play on. Yep. Plus, you might even get to see me in the boys chat every so often because I do like to hang out with my members. All right. So, 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 so. Not hard at all, but yes, we are on a insane beast, dude. I wish I remembered to get a Dermis. I totally forgot a Dermis tool. We can always do it again. But hey, we got Spider Flag. Super sweet. Let's move on to the next one. Time is a ticking. Vanilla Boss and Dragon this time and Hard Mode. I love how this mod actually allows you. It actually has all this stuff. It's really nifty. And then you don't have to go through all the shenanigans of teleporting. And no matter what map you're on, you'll always have all the vanilla guys. So always cool. Actually, something I usually just skip past and don't even bother with. Come on. Let's go, Dragon. I'm actually kind of surprised. The Broodmother actually did a little bit of damage to us. Normally, we are practically invincible. Oh, hello, Alpha Dragon. Where, whoa, where are you going, bro? Where are you going? Get wrecked. Dude, all right, that was the one. That was the one. It unlocked everything else that we needed. 
And we got a hologram! Super sweet! All right, thank you, thank you, thank you. You don't have anything else in your inventory, right? Nope. Can I? I can't harvest these things, right? Imagine dragon scales to make dragon armor. That would be so sick. Why nobody does that? I don't know. All right, where's your summoner? I got totally uh, displaced. All right, here we go. Ooh, come here, Mr. Manti. Let's get some polymer. Come here, bro. Polymer is always something I'm short on. And bada boom. Look at that. 439. Not bad. All right, moving on. So we next have Megapithecus. Is that the next one? Let's see. Matrix, Vanilla Boss, Gorilla. Hard. All right, and that leaves us. I might have to get some more artifacts. That might be a thing, but that's okay. We got plenty. Just unfortunately, you can't carry more than one of each type of artifact on your person. All right, come on. Come on. That's the other nice thing. This allows you to summon in every boss with... I, I can't remember if in vanilla, if you can do generic or if it actually... I think it actually specifies which artifacts you need for each boss. All right. I could be wrong, though. All right, Mega P, Alpha. It's funny how they're such low level, too. Oh, hey, look, see, another Tech Ingram I did not have previously. All right, get... I said, get! Everybody cleared? All right, fair enough. Let's move on to the final... Whoa, 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 Starburst. I know you're excited. I know you're excited. Just one more. One more, and then we can go home. All right, and... Oh, I have to go home, I think, anyway. Because I think we are one artifact short. Two artifacts short. Okay, but everything else we do have, so that's good news. I'm going to hold off on doing the Titans and the Aberration one until a future date. They're just a little bit longer of fights, and I don't feel like doing them today. If that's okay with you. Anyway, um, let me go run back to the base. We'll be right back. All right, I have returned with the artifacts. Let's go ahead and get this final boss over with. And summons and oh, Matrix Vanilla Manicore. There we go. And I'm pretty sure I've already taken on the uh, Phantasmal Manicore, Megapithecus, and Broodmother, which uh, probably is. Well, no, we did get something unlocked when we took on the Megapithecus. So maybe it has to be hard mode to actually unlock stuff. That could be a thing. Don't know. But anyway, for completeness, regardless, let's get this manicure done. Come on, buddy. And this one seems like it takes longer, doesn't it? Hey, hey. Ooh, 360 this time. Look at you, bro. All right. You going to make me fly? Fine. Come on. Oh, my goodness. All right. Again, no challenge whatsoever. But still cool. Ooh, and another hollow. Wow, that looks so much cooler than the actual manicore, doesn't it? Very epic drawings. Never really take the time to look at them. I always get so angry at Ark that those things pop up while you're in battle. Like, it shouldn't be a thing. It should be like a little thing pops up and says, like, press F1 to, go to view it. You know, why would you make things pop up or explore notes? All it does is like potentially kill you while you're stuck in a menu and flustered. Anyway, yup, that is everybody. And nothing else we got to worry about. So let's pick up our thing. Let's check real quick our Ingrams. And everything is now unlocked. There's a few other guys, but that is not part of vanilla. We got everything done, and I think this might have been one of the important ones. I don't think I had large tech walls done, and I needed that for the base plays. So, very, very cool. I might fight them again later, just because we can, to get all their dermises. But anyway, moving on to the next part of the day, I would like, if possible, to... Go ahead and get two Prime Wyverns. Um, 
they can breed together. Yeah, so we can start working on our prime wyvern army, and of course they evolve into what is one of my favorite creatures of all time in any mod. So super exciting. Let's head on over to the wyvern den. Ooh, we cannot forget. Um, let's get taming food going on. Well, that's crafting. I just want to check how uh, how did our little jug bugs do since last episode? Holy crap! Uh, looks like rents, and I use some of this stuff too. Seven thousand. This is so good. We have to go figure out what other jug bugs there are. I can remember in the past. Uh, there being a token jug bug, I have not seen one yet, but um, we'll have to keep our eyes open if that's still a thing. Um, I also happen to find that we got a new saddle stone. I just threw it on high voltage because we're about to use it, but I think this is our best yet. 685. Our previous best was, I think, just over six. So that's a pretty big score. Um, used to be able to upgrade those things, but I don't believe you can any longer. Um, anyway, we should now be ready for the wyvern den. Um, oh, I, I remember there's a den right up here. I can't remember where else. I feel like there's more than one. So let's keep our eyes open. We're looking for giant blue wyvern. I think it was over here. Maybe it was a little bit further. I always fly over it and I'm like, oh my God, I got to get out of here quickly. Um, mental note, there's lots of resurrecteds here. I always forget about that in this little area. That might be fun to go run through. Anyway, let's keep our eyes peeled. All right. This might be just the ice wyvern den. This, I feel like it is. I feel like there's a volcano part. It's funny. It's been a, it's been a hot second since I played on Lost Island. So a lot of the hot spots I forget about. Let's just peek in here real quick just to see. Um, do we, I'm pretty sure I've seen more than just Ice Wyvern in here. Look at you, Ruby. Wow, you're cool looking. All right, that's a shiny one. All right, that is... I don't believe the den we're looking for. Let's see. Can I see? This map is just so massive. All right. Looks like there's lava coming from over this direction. Let's head on over there. And we should. I remember the last time I played here was with Primal Fear. I remember there is, uh, I always called it the Ferox Cave. Absolutely terrifying cave. What's this little thing? There's, it looks a little funny. What are you? Ooh, shadow. Yeah, it's curled up in a ball. We still... Oh, there's another one just below me. Um, I still want to get a shadow main. We're going to have to look into that. Anyway, today is Wyvern Day. I've been wanting this for a while, and I've been putting it off. Let's see. There's mana armor, though. All right, I think this is the den right here. All right, so it shouldn't hopefully be too hard. 540 female. I think we can just start knocking these guys out. Come here. Boom. Let's do our best. With our armor stone, we should have plenty of survivability. Uh, resurrecteds we're going to have to be careful about. All right. Come on, bro. 165. It's, it's a pretty good... Oh, I was looking at the resurrected. All right. Come on. Oh, God. All right. So um, what's nice is that we likely can just knock these guys out and then uh at the end we can figure out what's actually the one we want to keep i have to be careful though i'm doing too much damage oh what happened i froze for a second Ooh. i don't know if the resurrected's hitting them all right, the alpha one's going to go down quick. Now, I think you can also evolve alphas into primes, which that actually might be uh, more of what we want to do. All right, dude, it's taking so much damage. Get knocked out, and then I got to lead this prime away. All right, it is knocked out. All right, prime, or I mean resurrected. Follow me. What is with this guy? Indominus Argy? 
I don't know if I've ever seen that before. That looks pretty cool. All right, I think that guy's distracted well enough. Let's go ahead and use a health potion. All right, what else we got? 520 male. So that would be our male-female combo. 580 male. That is a vanilla alpha. Let's go ahead and get him. We haven't got one of those before. Should be pretty dang easy to get. Yeah, one shot. Awesome. All right. Uh, hopefully there's no more res. Uh, there is. All right, what do we got? 580. That looks pretty good. That has a melee of 84. Um, what are you? Ooh, 600 male. Also 84. All right. Um, I think the 600's on me. Oh, crap. The resurrected's on me, too. Let's see if we can pull them both over this way. Oh, we got a mess. All right. Come on, guys. I might have been better off being on our Doom Doggo, the River Princess. All right, come on. Stay away from that rather resurrected. This would be our male and female combo, though. That's the one, right? 540. All right, we don't want it to get damaged, though. All right. Oh, let's stay away from that Indominus guy, too. You stay away. See, we don't want to kill it because it could summon in something even worse. Where did the guy go? I'm not crazy, right? It was just right here. Oh, there it is. There it is. All right, come on. Dominus can only be knocked out by Prime. Okay. We can also knock out that guy. That's actually pretty cool. Ooh. Did it just get shocked or did we knock it out? That might be another interesting thing, to be honest. All right. I'm being a little bit more careful with this guy to let the Torpor rise. Because I really want that 600. All right, come here, little. Get out of here. All right, give it some time. I think I was shocking the wyvern, and it would fall, and that's why we didn't see it. All right, how's it doing? Oh, it's so close. I definitely hit it again. It shocked. Yeah, it's exactly what's been going on. All right, I'm going to try and get it to be knocked out right by the other one. All right, come on. We just don't want it to fall in that den. All right, I think that should have been the final shot. Yep, down. Beautiful. All right, let's get this resurrected away from here. Come on, resurrected. Come over this way. And then maybe... I don't know if these guys aggro against other dinos. Alright, I'm going to fly up and around and hopefully... Yeah, it already lost aggro against us, I think. Yep. Alright, we should be golden, guys. Let's do a little health potion. We got another guy. What's going on with you? It's 520. Let's get this dude knocked out. Come on. Oh, crap. I definitely hit it after it went down. That's a sad face thing. All right. As long as I also only knock them out. Let me just make sure their torpor doesn't fall too quick. All right. As long as I only knock them out and don't kill them, they can't summon in anything. Still takes them a hot second. And they, you also got to be careful. They can do not a lot of torpor, but a little bit of torpor. 
Come on, buddy. Get knocked out. All right, going up, going up. This should be the knockout. And... And... Knocked out. All right, beautiful. All right, so this all being said, what are you? Yudi, let's just get this guy out of the way. All right, and I'm stuck at him. All right, so we have the 540 and the 600. Ooh, Eternal Alpha Lion. Um, I think this guy should... Hey, hey, hey. That's her 600 right there. It should get knocked out on its own, but we'll help. Come on. No, 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 no. Don't get away from our guy. All right, was that enough to totally knock it out? Yep. All right, there's a couple other baddies, but if we're quick, we should be okay. All right, two eternal meats. One, a two. And because we're not using a poison type, we got to starve it too. All right. Excellent! We got a perfect 600! Of course, if we had a shiny version, it could go higher than that. But for now, I think this will be plenty good. And I will keep my eyes open for shiny variants in the future. I assume it's also one, two. And taming potion. And we got it! What a score. All right, beautiful. Um, Next this dude I'm uh, oh you know what we can check I always forget like this is not a new thing but for me it's a new thing um oh it says is that the same one oh there's two different ones oh okay so if that's the 520 it's it got hit and let me just double check where did it even go so we want the 600 one because that was knocked out fine. And it's not damaged. Which I forget. I can also just click on it and it will show me where it is, won't it? Right there. That's why we can't see it. All right. Let's get all these guys out of the way. All right. You're out and you're out. Those guys will leave us alone. All right, dude, this is epic. All right, that's it. Oh, it's like invisible. That's so weird. All right, uh, it says one. Let's do it. Yes. Oh, that is so beautiful. I feel like it's, it's still lost levels, though. But it said it, we didn't hit it, so whatevs. Unless that was... That couldn't have been the five. Or was it? Hold on, let's look at her thing again. No. See, the other one's still out there, and the, it was a male, right? Uh, come on. Sometimes this happens. My mouse disappears. Anyway, we got it all. Let's get back to the base, and let's try these new guys out. Ooh, that's, that's the 520, right? Right? Yep, yep. Should we wake it up and get it just for breeding? You know, I kind of, I a little bit once, a little bit of me once too. It was pretty easy to knock out. And I don't know how common Indominus variants are. Stupid guy. All right, just please don't summon in something. The... All right, don't summon in anybody. All right, uh, where is this? Where'd he go? They turn like invisible, I think. Oh, weird. All right, all right, let's just do it. Let's get a mating pair for him. Ooh, look at, look at, because of the alphas. Yes. All right, we'll worry about that later. Where is it? What the crap? Oh. It's so bizarre how they turn invisible. 
All right. Um, do I have anything to wake it up? Stamina potion, grind beef, poison eraser. Oh, please don't kill me, bro. Please, please, please don't kill me when I do this. Oh! All right, we good, we good. That did no... Oh, it's their poison eraser still working on it, maybe? I feel like it might have ruined it. Okay, there we go. There we go. Oh! Are you kidding me? Diving Wyvern. I remember those. Rip. All right, we're back. If I can teleport my guy back to me, I'm just going to say forget him. Yeah, we can. All right, good job. High voltage, holy crap. Good thing we put that extra staddle on you, but look at we finally got the levels to finish leveling it up. That is cool. All right, but anyway, you get packed up, bro. I went and grabbed two wyvern saddles, and I already had an RG saddle drop. I got to remake it to improve it better, but um, for the time being, the wyverns are what we want. They are absolutely what we want. Except I would like to get a baby so that we can get the imprinting and everything. Um, I still, I think I'm going to end up adding best eggs in and I have not done that yet, but I think that's going to be a thing. I just get so spoiled after using it one season. It's like, oh, it's such a task and it's always an off camera task too. So it just helps me to get more uh, time for recording with you guys. All right. We got one. Do not know if it's going to be the best, but I'll let it lay a couple of eggs and then let's hatch them out. All right. We got quite a few eggs. Let's see if we can get lucky enough to get. Let me just see. Um, We want 123, 119. So 123 and 127 would be the most ideal. So let's see if we get it. Let's go, little wyvern. Come on. Don't be a long time, please. Yes. Aw, oh, look at the babies. All right, super sweet. Well, let's see. What did we get? So that's, we got the melee. That we got neither. Didn't get the melee. Okay, here's a good one. That's actually a really good one. Let's see. Nope. Nope. Uh, nope. 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 That's another good one. All right. We got a male and a female. Good one. Not bad. Those will be our two for now anyway. All right. Let's hop on down and let's try these bad boys out. So these now are fully grown and imprinted. Beautiful. Let's go ahead, throw on the saddles, which I've already made a blueprint for. And as you can see, when I put on the saddle, we get all these different cool potential upgrades that we can do. And what we want, let me see, is probably what we're going to want. Probably a fire and a poison are my favorite. Yeah, the unknowns. That is so cool. All right. And oh, I'll get they don't know. Oh, I'll, I'll get the uh, the stone for it now. Oh, and um, let's also not forget you, sir, which I may save until next time to try out. But all right, good. That is the saddle, in fact, for it. You are so cool, bro. I just want to see what are some moves for this guy. Oh, it goes invisible. You know, this is one of the few mods. Yeah, it gets extra damage when it comes out, when it's invisible and it strikes. That is so cool. Is it? You know what? This is the old art, the way an RG used to look before. 
the update, isn't it? Before the old TLC? Oh, I miss this. All right, anyway, it kind of looks a little different to me still. I feel like it it's, doesn't stand, uh, they used to stand taller, but that's the face for sure. Very cool. Super excited about that. That was just a bonus. All right, but anyway, let's start leveling. Uh, we'll get, let's get one of them leveled up today, and then we have to save up on tokens before we can actually go and uh, do anything more, before we can evolve. So we'll probably work on that into the future. Not bad, 63 thou. Oh, that is a beautiful thing. And then I think all prime wyvern are fire type initially. But it's not the prime where they're the most powerful. It's once they get to their evolutions. Very cool. And I do expect I will try and eventually breed these to two, if I can, to 255 uh, or 254. And at least the health in the melee. We'll work on that into the future, though. That will be a project. Oh, it's so much fun. I missed you guys. Ooh. All right, and then I think these guys can pick up pretty big stuff too. Look at that. We picked up a Bronto. Oh, wow. It is so fast. And of course it can fly backwards and everything too. Oh, it is so awesome. Get wrecked. All right, anyway, um, let me get it maxed out in level and let's see how strong it's gonna get. All right, the last 10 levels, 255. All right, buddy, bro, and 179,000. That is awesome. Now, of course, after breeding, we can probably get it to be so much higher. And then once we evolve it, it should be at, you know, godly levels, quite possibly one of the stronger creatures. You know, it, it's getting up there. But um, I think a cool thing, I, I'm not positive. Let's find out. Can I fly in the water? No, I can't fly in the water. I thought for sure I'd be able to, you know, because the uh, some of the guys can. But not these ones. Not these ones. Our special abilities that we can pick up a lot. Now, we died to something that was called a diving wyvern. Um, That's a wyvern that I, I think it can, like, dive bomb almost or something along those lines so actually pretty cool what the crap are you oh what does this guy do indominus tier uh it does unknown torpor is that what it said uh or is it it takes that to knock out okay i don't know if i've ever had this guy um it's only a 380 so we'll worry about it another time but might get something cool from it is a drop. Um, I can't really tell. We had another one, another 380. All right, you want to go too? Let's go. Now I am noticing. Okay, so of course we do inflamed with that, but we're doing. Yeah, that uh, gnashed. Or, yeah. Um, that can be a problem sometimes. While it's great for fighting, I mean, I guess we're already maxed out, but. I thought we were maxed out. I'm seeing more levels. What's going on? I actually had a crap ton of more levels I was able to put on my player. Do I have more player levels? What is going on? It's got to be because we, like, when we defeated a lot of the bosses. Huh. All right. I got my crafting skill up to 2,000. Of course, that's with the armor. But not going to complain. Not going to complain. So all in all, pretty epic and awesome day. And this guy is confirmed, yes, maxed out. So I think we're going to have to start working on breeding of these guys. Um, I'll kick off next episode. I'm a little short on time, unfortunately. But um, we can kick off tomorrow with our new Indominus RG and find out if that's any good. And maybe, maybe we can find a breeding partner for it too. But yes. Wyvern breeding project is uh, definitely going to happen. We just got to get into the new base. 
Um, we have to get in there so that we have enough space because this place is just too small to breed wyvern but uh anyway both wyvern will get a name for next episode so i hope you guys leave some epic name suggestions but uh yeah i think it is that time let me go through those comments all right guys i just finished going through the comments and yes it is now that time that's right Time to name the dinos! For those of you that do not know, at the end of every single episode, I go through the comments of the previous episode, and I pick out all the most awesome name suggestions that you guys leave in the down there. That's right. Just remember, if you want to have a chance of getting your name chosen, you got to be a subscriber. So smash that subscribe button, and yeah, just comment down below it is just that easy oh my goodness anyway for today we have got the stego and the dodic to name and their names will be barney the stego and dylan the dodic all right welcome to the tribe guys for next time we need names for our new indominus rg and for our two prime wyverns so help me out guys in the comments below anyway thank you all so very much for watching it's been a pleasure as you always do please remember to show that amazing support for the series by smashing that thumbs up button if you're new to the channel or you haven't yet please do not forget to subscribe for the daily arc awesomeness and as always guys i'll see you tomorrow thanks again and peace out